After the Bell is brought to you by Business Equity and Opportunities. Let's go ahead and welcome in Brian Martin from Los Angeles with our After the Bell report. Brian Ford had a really bad day, huh? Boy, good evening, Phil and Alexis. That might even be putting it lightly, Phil. The automaker's stock fell 12% today, knocking $7 billion off the company's market value. It is Ford's worst day for its stock in more than 11 years. It all comes after an ominous warning yesterday. Ford said it was facing a billion dollars in unexpected supplier costs. It's also dealing with more supply chain problems and parts shortages. On the markets, investors expect another 75-point rate hike by the Fed coming tomorrow. The Dow lost 1% today, or 313 points. Gap says it's cutting 500 corporate positions. Sales are way down for the clothing retailer. Gap also recently cut ties with Kanye West and his Yeezy brand. It's also having some troubles at its Old Navy brand as well, which, by the way, last year accounted for more than half of the company's sales. Well, we now know exactly how many people in Indiana will benefit from the student loan forgiveness program. The White House says 856,000 people are eligible for at least $10,000 of loan forgiveness. 555,000 people who got Pell Grants can get up to $20,000 of loan forgiveness. Reporting live, I'm Brian Martin. Phil, Alexis, back to you guys. Well, hey, Brian, before we let you go, Spotify jumping into mm-hmm. some audiobooks I hear. Yeah, pretty cool. Spotify says it is a substantially untapped market. Users can now buy and listen to more than 300,000 different audiobook titles. It puts Spotify, though, in direct competition with Amazon-owned Audible, who's the current leader in the audiobook space. You guys fans of uh, listening to an audiobook, cozying up by the fire? What is it for you guys? I mean, I'm getting more into it, especially as I'm taking walks, things like Mm. that. You know, multitask. I'm more of an old school book kind of guy, but I've been kind of opening up to the audiobook. He needs to. Okay, there you go. I think I'm with you, Phil. Yeah. (laughs) All right, Brian. Thank you. We'll see you tomorrow.